Hello everyone, welcome back to another video, and today I'm going to be showing you the locations of all of the secret chests in Roblox High School 2. Now the first chest is down here in the basement, which you will need the basement key to access. You can buy that from Maddie during the weekends. Now when you get down here, you're going to want to go to the door marked with a peace sign. Once you get in, you're going to want to go through this box arch and up this blue ladder to where this chair is. Then you jump onto the green hammock and over to this vent with an X on it. Keep traveling along here and you'll arrive at the first chest. Now the next chest is located in the beach cave. So from here, you're going to want to fly over to this little dark outcropping in the wall. Go on and fly in. And now if you go to this edge of the wall here, you'll see that one of these walls is actually an invisible wall. So you just have to walk through it and then you can get access to the second secret chest. Now the third chest is located in the sewers. So again, you can access this one from the beach. You just go over to this rusty little gate here. And now once you go through, you're going to want to go to nearly the end of the sewers. And you're going to want to go into this pipe right here, the second to last one. And when you enter, you just want to follow along the pipe. Until you get to this grate. This grate is a sign that you're headed in the right direction. You keep going down the pipe until you get to this area right here where it falls off. And once you end up here, you're going to want to go down to this little cracked bit where the light is coming out. And you're going to want to jump down that. And then you'll find yourself in the chest area. And then when you want to leave, you just press E to teleport out and it'll get you back up here. Now the third chest is located in the enchanted forest. So you have to go up to this tree at night and through this little white area here. You can't access this during the day. And then once you get inside, the chest is actually located above you. So you are gonna need a flying device in order to get up to it. So you fly up to the top here and it's right on top of this top branch, you'll find the chest. Now the final chest is located in the mines. So follow along very closely with these instructions because they can be very confusing. Now once you get in the mines, you're going to want to go through the middle doorway. You want to go past the exit to your right. Keep going straight until you can make a left here and make the left, keep going straight. Then you're going to want to make this right, right here. Keep going straight until you get to that intersection, then make a left. And then you want to make another left. You're going to follow along the corridor. Now you're going to go straight past that intersection, straight again, straight again. And then once you get here, now, I go this way on accident, but it's actually very helpful because it really does show the best way to go. So once you go back around in here, you'll see that there is a way forward through the middle. You want to take that route. And following the corridor until you get here, take another left. Then follow along until you get here, take another left. Then finally take this right, and now you'll be on the path to the chest. So keep walking, it's a long road. And at the end, here is the final chest. Now this means the totals give you 1,250 diamonds for only 50 Robux, which is a huge steal. 
Uh, and that is it. So thank you for watching everyone. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video and leave any future suggestions in the comments down below. Thanks for watching and bye.